Hi everyone with the spirit of learning, thank you for coming back to my video in YouTube. My name is Angga from Indonesia. And if you are new, make sure that you hit the subscribe button because you're gonna get a lot of more updated from me about the mobile development, UI UX, and website design. So if you click this video, probably that you were thinking about something about mobile development. So do you have to remember any source code, any code in the development? in the as a programmer you know when i first time learn about the programming i was thinking like that i was thinking that i have to remember all of them every single line of code i have to remember but the, actually i don't have to why it is because human brains is not designed to remember things human's brain is designed to learn something to adapt and then to solve the problem in the world so actually you don't have to remember anything so if you are if you were dreaming something it could be you don't remember anything right you just uh, you were sleeping and then you were dreaming something but when you wake up you don't remember even you remember just for the short time after that you don't remember anymore so the reason why i don't have to remember any single line code it is because i don't have to it is because i rather to solve the problem instead of uh, remembering for the every single line of development or programming language when i say like that hey i don't have to remember and then suddenly my friend told me that okay you don't have to remember then how do you work in the mobile development it's easy currently we are living in the era information we have google we have stack overflow we have facebook groups that helps you to discuss each other that helps you that provides you that gives you a lot of content regarding of the mobile development so that's why instead of remembering every single line code why don't you improve your own uh, skills in regards of the problem solving so problem solving is the number one and the second, you're doing your own programming language. You're doing your own code. So number one is problem solving. How do you solve any problems with your brains? And then you convert that solution to become the Android application, to become the application with the programming language. Okay, Angga, I don't have to remember uh, any code anymore. So how do I work for the efficiently? All right, so if you want to work efficiently without remembering any code, you just need to remember the basic things. If, if else, else if. That's all, yeah. The fundamental of programming, that's all. If he buys this and then else, if else he buys this and then what? yeah that's all that's the basic fundamental sorry that's the basic basic foundation of the programming language actually once you know once you understand how do you work use if else else if properly you can make a big application like the facebook previously mark jagabar was coding for the php just if else if switch that's all the basic basic foundation so you don't have to remember any single line of code it hurts your brain because you know actually programmer or developer is solving problem not writing a thousand of single line of code you know not writing but thinking this is really crucial but mostly programmer think that they have to remember they have to writing a thousand of every single code but actually once your brains uh, can solve any problems once you practice to your brains and then you are growing up in the programming skills right so that's why you don't have to remember you don't have to remember any single line of code if you need something just remember the basic things like the user flow like the uh, how do you ask to the group? Yeah, this is really important. This is about attitude. So I think 
I'm going to make the video about how do you ask the error or the question regarding of the mobile development to the to the everyone yeah to get the response better all right because sometimes we are wrong to ask question we we, we didn't know how do we ask the better question to solve our problems so i'm going to make the video about that later on so for you if you are interested to starting to not remembering any single line of code i suggest you to learn basic ux why why ux is for this kind no ux for everyone once you know about basic ux how do you design the layout probably you you gonna improve your own skills as a developer as a programmer so basically ux is for everyone ux is so large it connected to any fields right so you have to learn basic ux about how do you uh, put the button how do you design the layout how do you make an animation the micro interaction in your product so after you learn ux you're gonna understand how do you design and how do you develop the best application okay for example i don't remember code how do i prompting the message how do i show the message to the user so basically i just remember i have one button and if i if user if user click this button it will give the user a notification like hello world or like hey you click this button but i don't remember how do i do that so first i just need to provide the design first design first i provide the design first in the xml i put the button i give them id i connect to the java so in the java i'm going to search in the google how do i connect xml and java so I just declare a new variable for the button and button id's name and then after that uh, back to the idea the idea was if I click the button if I click the button it shows the messages to the user okay so I have to find in Google how do I showing the messages to the user if I click the button so I have to use on click event so i have button i put on click event and then after that what happens it's showing the messages and that's all that's pretty simple right so you have to know first how your application works and then you don't have to remember code you just searching on the google stack overflow facebook groups there's a lot of resources that you can do that you can join to improve your own development skills so for you if you are fresh graduated and then if you are new in the mobile development i suggest you don't have to remember any single line of code just remember the basic foundation if else else if after that learn about ux yeah we just for the basic ux and then after that you make your own app just simple app maybe you want to make to-do list or you want to make alarm or you want to make a wallpaper app yeah so you can watch this video about wallpaper, wallpaper app yeah I have uploaded that videos so you can learn alright so I think that's all this because I don't remember any single line of code I just rely on the Google and rely on my brands how do I solve the problem because I have basic UI and UX so it's gonna be easier for me as long I understand how my product works properly right so thank you for watching and let me know if you are still confused so i'm gonna help you just write in the videos comment and let me know your problems all right so nice to meet you from indonesia see you in the next time have a nice day good morning guys bye